Hey folks, Swip here, and welcome back to another episode on Empire's SMP. Today we've got a bunch of big plans and plenty of meetings planned with the other members. Now after last episode, we spent a lot of time working on the base and we got this entire wall section built up and terraforming done all the way around here and it looks super duper amazing beyond sending the souls of our fallen salmon to rest back over at the Ocean Empire. But this has me super inspired here as I want to keep working on the base even further today. If you're excited, please leave a like on this video and sub if you're brand new. Helps me out a bunch. Thank you so very much. I really do appreciate y'all. Now I've got a bunch of empty shulker boxes right here and one partially filled one and it is time to fill them all up with a bunch of sand. I've been loving doing some work with glass recently and I would love to just get a bunch of that on hand so we can do a lot of really cool things around our area. There it is, my favorite desert on the entire Empire's SMP. I think we're gonna, by the end of the season, I think I'm gonna have claimed all of this sand for myself, but let's get digging. Does this give you anxiety? Because it gives me a lot of anxiety. Look at the durability on that tool. There's no color in it. It's just black. Scary, scary. Almost lost it. Next up, we do need to be smelting a lot of this glass down and what the heck is happening in here? Please load in. But I also need to repair the shovel. So I figured we could run over to the blaze farm super fast and just AFK here for a little while, get some blazes and then kill them and repair the whole shovel. Oh my. I went downstairs to go eat some cantaloupe and then there's so many places. All right, that's close enough for now. We actually have a meeting with Gemini Tay and Catherine to go meet up right now. And I am way late there waiting for me at my base right now. We got to talk to them about a few spooky dream things that have happened recently involving good old Zorzor. That's my new pet name for our old little demon friend over here. Oh, little Zorzor, he's so cute. Hello, Flip. Hi, Catherine. Hi, Jem. Thank you both so much for being Hi, here. Jen. Sorry, I'm a, I'm a little tardy over here, but welcome to the Grimlands. Lovely weather today, isn't it? Thank you, thank you. Uh, Hello. Yeah, it's very nice out. Um, uh, just just a quick question. Have you experienced anything weird lately? Despite all like the dead things that I didn't put down around here, yeah, no, just no, yeah, uh, maybe a little bit. You got quite a bit of corruption. There's Aren't you blood. gonna clean this up? Yeah, yeah. You should clean this. Look at your chimney. Yeah, I should probably. That? Yeah. My whole chimney okay. is now bloody red. I don't know what's going on with it, but this That's isn't weird. sanitary. This is this this is not sanitary. No, I got, I need got to cool. get rid of this. Oh, As you mentioned, good. weird things happening. I had yeah, a dream where this, I got captured by Mr. Zorzor. And I I just woke up and there was a plant next to my bed. I had a dream and there was a plant next to my bed too. Jen. What? Here. right? Uh, I, yeah, I also had a dream. For some reason, I sleep inside my storage room, but it looked like this. Yeah, it did look like that. that. Yeah, it did. But why did you keep that? I got rid of mine and burned it. I don't so really sleep here that often. It, it's a why, rare occurrence why, why that I actually keep... sleep in that bed. I'm protecting you. Thank you. Where's yeah, your nearest fire? There's blood as well. Look at what. I, yeah. Come on. I'm sorry. Come on, Flip. On cleaning. I'm, I'll clean it up. I'll clean it up. I'm sorry. Flip, where's your nearest fireplace? Instant fire. Goodbye. <laughs> you know who I am. Always instant fire. <laughs> Oops. Oops. Yeah, it and said it's... that it was experimenting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In my dream, it said that I was a test subject or something. Yeah, I got locked in a little I don't, I don't chamber in a tube. On. That's, no. that's bad. How do we? How do we not? How do we? We know how to not be tested on. I'm not. That, sure. That's a great question. And I've been trying yeah. to do a little bit of research on the dude, yeah. and I've been keeping a journal of everything that I've mm -hmm. found so far. And great, we can compare notes. Oh, you've been taking notes too. Oh my god, this uh, is amazing. Wow, you, have notes. you have notes. I haven't been taking any. No, I don't have any notes. I just, I just Kevin, had a dream. On, you go, you my house was down. filled with stuff, and then we know that's who it. Catherine is on up. the group project. Then. What? 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 <laughs> well, well. <laughs> it's okay, Catherine. We'll compare notes anyway. So I've been trying to keep track of like how many times we've seen the thing, which my account is way off right now. I was saying three in my. Comments were telling me that it's more closer to like 10 or 7. I, I, I'm going with like seven different locations right now. And uh, then. Really? Yeah. That's a lot. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm worried about our cliffs. little apprentice wizard over at the. Uh, the Mythlands. I, I think he's. Uh, I think he's in line with him. He's a, a bit. fake wizard. Believe that. That's why I said apprentice. Costume. I said apprentice. He's a little wannabe, but it's fine. <laughs> He's using dark magic. It's not right. And you know nothing about how this started with. Nope, that one, that one, I have no idea at all. Absolutely I no idea. I think it came from Shovel. Mm. 
It, it told me, anyways. I have it in my notes that that shovel knew where it came from very far away. Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put that down in mine. Cheater. Really, 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 really likes the idea of the dragon being dead. So I'm, I'm a wee bit oh, worried about that. So we need to not kill the dragon. Wait, yeah. but if it wants it dead, wouldn't that make it happy and go away? I don't See, think that's I'm, how demons work. The thing is, it's oh. saying it wants the dragon dead in forms of saying it'll be free. And oh. powerful. Oh. Yeah. Oh, okay. So yeah, bad. that that do it. that worries me. <laughs> I guess we're okay. still just researching and seeing what's going on, and uh, the the yeah. last thing I can say is be very careful of sausage. I'm I'm worried about He's that. He's a bit one. sus, isn't he? He's oh. a bit sus. Not sustainable. Just just sus. Okay. Well, Suspicious. I'll keep my eye out. And since I, I guess I'm the only one here with the least amount of Zorzor experience, um, I'll let you know if anything new happens. Yes, keep us in the loop. I think, yeah, I think between the three of us, we should maybe not share all this information around unless we get something in yeah, return. Because I don't want it going back to Sausage and him being able to profit oh, off of this. So. Moving on from the evilness, that is Zorzor, my friends. There's some lovely things happening on the server today. There's a wedding, and I figured a great wedding gift for everybody there could be uh, bringing a nice fireworks show as a present from the Grimland. So let's see if we can set that thing up. Got a good amount of green in here, and I've got a good amount of white, and I don't have, I guess we can use the red to make some pink. There we go, that should be awesome. Okay, do we have any more white though? Perfect, okay, that should be amazing for the amount of rockets we need to make today. Gonna need some more paper so that we can make all the rockets for ourselves. This would be such a great time to bring everybody on the server together and forget everything that's uh, happened scarily in the past. And perfect, we got a stack and a half of each. So if we set up a few dispensers down there and use an observer or something to make them go shoo, 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 it's gonna be amazing. So we could kind of lift it. Not to interrupt too much. Where would you like the fireworks show set up? <laughs> Good question. Nice. Should we should we all exit? Which which way? We the best do we exit this way? Which, um, or do we want it, it out over the water? We could. We could actually do it over <gasps> the water. Like the this will water. be the main entrance. You could do the entrance here at the beginning, yeah. but then it, we you could have the celebration on this side. Yeah, oh, yeah. that'll be like lovely. Disney. Yes, yes, yeah. yes, yes, yes. Well, I guess this is the spot to set up the whole thing. So uh, I'm gonna get working. It's a busy one over there. It's a busy one. I'll just, I'll set up my thing and let them do theirs. Okay, well it's primed. I guess we just load it and then we'll see how it looks. Do one of you want to go stand over there and I'll put like three or four in each of the dispenser? It works. Welcome to my new random AFK spot where I use all of Pearl Sugar Cane, so I'm gonna sit here for a little while, but on with the celebrations. Hello everyone, welcome to the Church of the Blood Sheep. You are gathered here today uh, for a wedding from Joel and Lizzie. Come on in. Let's go. Get on uh, inside. Hello, hello, blood sheep. Hello. Hello, hello. 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 congratulations. All hail, blood hello. Hello. Here. all hail blood sheep. Welcome everybody. Today we are here to join the union of Smallish Beans and LD Shadow Lady. Wow! Stunning! Joel, have you got tears? Joel, have you got tears? Just getting Gorgeous. them out of the way. Wow! By the power invested in me, which is not much, I now pronounce you man and wife. Yeah! Yay! 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 Woo! Woohoo! Wow. Oh, 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 oh,
Coming back over to the base now, my friends, after a lovely wedding, I've been doing a lot of work around here. I decided to just start getting decorating, to be honest. I've just been wanting to have some fun time just building around this world and really working on the base. So I finished up this entire section over here, waiting for as much of that sand to smelt down into glass as we can. As uh, you can see here, it's making good progress. We're about even to just get the blaze rods smelting. But check this out. We got a big old spruce tree here with a lantern inside of it. And then I set up this weird little little market stall or whatever we want to call it over here workstation of sorts we got some fletching tables so we might get some fletching villagers around here if someone want to trade and then the biggest thing probably the most subtle change but the biggest game changer i think of them all is something is missing around here something is completely missing at this point in time no it's not the corruption because i forgot a few blocks like that one I spent the time because uh, I was tired of getting made fun of by Jem and Catherine earlier. They were saying my base was an absolute mess. I hid every single one of the torches underneath a piece of moss, and it looks a million times better. Oh man, I wish I had done this earlier. So the entire contained village section, besides a few of the torches hanging around like there, where I couldn't quite put them underground, but we might be able to do this guy. We got the market stall. I got another new tree right up in here, and it's looking so very good. These ones, I'm not too sure what to do because I can't really hide them underneath brick. The moss is going to stand out a lot, and I want this square area to be clean. So if you have ideas, let me know down in the comments below. I completely forgot I found these little mini blocks from a wandering trader, but check this out right over here. We have a beehive. It's a baby beehive. I love it. And some pumpkins for our pumpkin wagon. Oh, this is going to be amazing. It's the little details, my friends. It's the little details. Next up here, my friends, it's time to do some shenanigans involving the Wither Rose Alliance, and more specifically, Wither Roses. I was thinking it'd be a really good idea before we move over to building up an HQ with everybody there, as I'm assuming we're going to want to use a lot of Wither Roses to decorate for that. So why don't we build a farm? This is easy, right? This is, this is easy. Yeah, we just go in there, we go to the Nether Fortress, and kill a bunch of Wither Skulls and Skulls. Skulls, skeletons, and then we get the skulls. See, told you, so easy, first kill. Leading ourselves here two minutes later into this and skull number two, we'll take it. Don't worry, I swear YouTuber luck isn't a thing here. We're only like six minutes into being in the nether fortress and there's number three. I think that was the fastest it's ever taken me to get three skulls by myself. That might have even beaten the record of doing this with Gem and Sausage earlier. Now that we got these three boyos, the next step I figured is we need to get some eggs so that we can summon a chicken inside of there. And I think I've murdered all of the chickens in this area. We've got one. Hello. Hi. How are you doing? This way, my beautiful little uncooked nuggy. You've done it. Welcome to the Grimlands, my friend. Here's our greeter, Mythical Sausage. And welcome to your new forever home, right in this pit where you'll never see sunlight again. Amazing. AFK long enough and the chickens will giveth. We have almost two stacks of eggs. The only thing I need is ender pearls. And well, we're going to the ends. I just now need to travel through the Ocean Queen's land and see if I can remember how to get out there. Follow the fallen souls of the salmon. We're on our way. So let me love to bed here. All right, we're gonna, we're gonna set our spawn. Oh, hi dragon. Yeah, we don't want to kill you. We definitely don't want to kill you. We're just going this way now. Goodbye, End Island. Now that we're out here, I get the fun task of trying to find an exit portal, but we should be able to find something out here a little ways. I think. I really hope. Please. I've been flying for 15 minutes and I haven't found anything. So I just checked the wiki and it seems like they do spawn. So there's hope, there's hope. I just have to find one. I think I found just a new elytra right here. <gasps> this looks like a fresh ship. Yes, there it is, we have one. Completely unintentional, but I will take it. We've found one here, my friends. Oh my gosh, there's three, <laughs> there's three of them. Oh, I hate everything. Oh, there's three. We're gonna use this one. This one right over here. This is gonna be our way home. Well, not our way home. This is what we're gonna be using to build our farm. Well, I guess first step in this plan here, my friends, is one, we could build the whole farm. That would probably be smart, but I think I'm gonna spawn proof just the nearby area with all of this water so we don't have any issues. Excuse me, buddy. Thank you. I've covered an absolutely massive area full of water here, my friends, and I know they're still spawning on the far side, but I think it's actually gonna be okay because our AFK platform is gonna be way high in the sky up here, so it shouldn't matter too much. Now, next we need to conduct some Minecraft magic. And by magic, 
I mean, we have to use a bug. And this little bug right here is a mushroom. Look at that. Oh, it's amazing. And the portal's gone. All right, so now we can trap a wither in there. Yeah, easy stuff. Now, the design we're using today is going to be the one by Shulkercraft, just since it's very, very easy to follow. And hopefully, I should be able to do this without uh, letting a wither loose inside of the world. I'm trying to build this central thing inside of one chunk so that it works a lot better i'll tell you what here folks i've just got a lot of blocks to place down in this one so let's go ahead and kick this off in a good old-fashioned time-lapse mode and hopefully come back with a working with a rose farm yeah let's do it things are not going well over here uh not only did i not bring enough building blocks and we're stuck with this monstrosity right here that i won't be too concerned if the weather actually blows it up is um i also forgot the name tags so i can't even finish this build we have to go back to the overworld and come back out here and yeah nice trip into the void let's do it fun times goodbye cruel world back over at the base where I have no levels and do we even have name tags we have a lot of buckets of salmon but no name tags I think I might just go pinch one or two from sausage Should I, I'll we'll do, take two from him and we'll leave two piece and friendship roses it's fine here it is the storage room of mythical sausage all right where are the name tags this man's storage room it hurts it hurts my soul I, I need to borrow one of these there's one no <laughs> it's already used we're gonna go buy some. Hello, I need two of these, thank you very much. Appreciate it. It'll be fine, it'll be fine, totally fine. Hi, I have a question for you. I need your help on something. Very, very important. Mostly because I'm out of levels. Uh, name this name tag, whatever you want. All right, uh, anything I want. Anything you want, totally fine. Yeah? Yeah. Oh. Cool, thanks. That, that'll be fine. It's gonna go live in the void now. Wait, what, what, huh, what? Interesting choice of name tag over here, but I guess that's actually we need to go to Lizzie's. We have to get back to the void to the end <gasps> We finally got one. No, he fell down Get up here little man get up here. Come on over this way now over here Homie's gonna kill me and we already used the name tag. So this is not good There we go. Finally, <laughs> he's in there it appears to be working, so that is super cool. Oh, I just looked at them all. I just looked at them all. That's not good. Well, here's time for the terrifying part of, did we do this right or is it gonna completely mess up? We're just gonna summon a nice little wither inside of here. It's gonna be fantastic. We got the wither rose farm thing ready to go. And all we should need to do is wither skulls like that. And then we place water in here. Otherwise that will really mess up everything. And we hide. And now this farm is super loud. I need to get rid of that water source. And then we break this. And he should have found them. Should have found chicken. Appears to be working. I think it's working. Now I want to name tag him. There we go, the Fwither Rose Farm. It's ready. It's done. This is working. There's roses. Oh my gosh, it's working. Well, now all we need to do is fly high into the sky and AFK for a while. And I really hope I didn't mess this up. We will see how this goes. I've been AFK here for about an hour at this point, got the whole video edited up, and I'm really curious to know how much loot we got. So I think it's about time to fly on down here. He's still in there, so that is fantastic. What do we got down here? Hello there, I will take that. What is going on? <laughs> Gotta make sure I catch all of these shulker boxes so they don't go into the void. That would be very sad. Oh no, one of those was my shulker boxes for actually putting my own stuff back in there. Oh, that's not good. We've done it, my friends. We have unlimited wither roses, which is going to be absolutely amazing. But now time for another trip to the void. Back home we go. I have a, yep, I have no equipment. That's good. Goodbye again. No, I just want to go home. I just, I just want to go home. Mike, be cute, please. Please. No, we don't have to do this. We don't have to, we don't have to, no. My walk starts again. Ran back over to Mithlan to be uh, smart this time. Let's just, let's just borrow. Where, where's my stuff? Where's my stuff? In here, please. Yes, okay. It's been such a long journey, I forgot where it was. Now that we're back here in the Grimlands, I figured it was time to show off our newfound power of having unlimited wither roses. And what better way to do it than planting a withering field inside of our area. So I figured a good first step here was running into the nether to collect up a bunch of soul soil here so we can make the ground texture a little bit more interesting than just being dirt. One shulker box later and we are all good to go. 
And now, my friends, it's time to put our farmer flip cap right back on over here as we are planting a giant field of wither roses here in front of the Grimlands. From there, it was time to start terraforming, so I completely tore out a large grassy section, put all the soul soil down, and then decided to just fill in the roses on top of it and put some coarse dirt around until I turned out to be a little bit of an idiot, and, uh, well, you'll see. Oh. Oh, I'm dumb. No! <laughs> Why am I here? Gonna be all right. There's all of our stuff in a field. We've got our grand new field over here where we're growing up the little wither roses and I think they look fantastic. I'd love to get some dead bushes along the edge here too, but those are a little hard to obtain over in the desert. Might have to go there soon, but I'm feeling a little mischievous. Mischievous, and apparently we might need to train some gunpowder. Pearl could be our first target. Where we're gonna need an invisibility potion and we're gonna be needing What's that? We need we need a few wither roses. I'm gonna bring about a stack of them with me. I think we need all of our invis potions, to be honest. And of course, we have a shulker box of gunpowder, and uh, she might have some stored away. But still, she engaged contact. We respond. The plan here is drink the invisibility potion, and then see if we can kill somebody just by running around with wither roses. <laughs> I'm not sure it's gonna work, but we're gonna see if we can do it. Here we are in Pearl's land, taking the invisibility potion. We've got eight minutes, and as long as we're not holding anything, we are good to go. I think we got her. I don't, it didn't do much, but I think we got her. This is very awkward because I know she sees the potion particles. <laughs> Pearl's too good at this. She's too good at this. <laughs> It's not working out that well. It's not working out. She's too good. She's running away. She's too smart. She's too smart for us. It's too smart. You can't do it. It's too smart. She's too, she's too good at this game. We need an easier prey. We need a much easier prey. We're over in Catherine's land now, and I think this might be our most successful attempt here is what is going on in there? I can see her particles. Dang it. Instantly called out on that one. Okay. Well, I Ow! <laughs> get back here. Get back here! <laughs> I've died to enough today, so I figured somebody else one. had to die today too. So hi, I came over no, here. I, I went to go by the pro, but she's too good. She's she's too good at this game. So Catherine, you have to you have to let me kill you with a flower. No. Catherine, Catherine, it has to happen. Catherine, no. Hi. 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 No, it's it's look, look at the Hello? box. Look at the box. <laughs> look in the box. <laughs> were you the, were you trying to kill me no, before? No, look, just look in the, look Why in the box. Okay. <laughs> I want that. I want that though. I want to go back. What? No. Come on. I'm getting that. I'm getting it. It's mine now. Mine. Ah, it's, <laughs> Wait, mine. it's mine. I didn't get it. No. <laughs> yeah. Feel free to take as oh. much as you need. <laughs> oh, as much as I need. Just, just I mean, not the, the box, thing. but like. Not the box? You're yeah. going to surround me with the roses though. That yeah. doesn't do much damage to me, you know. Yeah, they're kind of not as great so as hard, I but... remember them being. Not not as great <laughs> as I remember them being. Now, Joel's hardly ever at his base unless he's building something. So it might be a little hard to get him, but we'll see. We'll see. I'm going to land down here in the front. We're just going to walk right up. Here we observe the wild, smallish bean sorting through his mess of shulker boxes, trying to find a specific shade of terracotta for his build over here. Will he find it? We do not know. Will he, will he catch his prey? It looks like he has found his prey for the day. He has selected his catch back up into this build. The Joel seems to be overcompensating for something as they build a very, very large nest for themselves to, to live in. One block at a time, the whole contraption comes together and it is beautiful. Beautiful to watch firsthand. Oh, and now the planks are added behind. So many layers, so much diagonal. Oh, we have a misplaced there. Will he regain it? We do not know. Come across a bit of a problem here. Roses can't be placed on terracotta. So uh, I don't, I don't think, I don't think we can, I don't think we can do it. What we can do though, he'll never expect this. Just rearrange the shulker boxes. We won't say anything. We're just gonna move them around. How to truly mess with the builder? Change where their shulker mess is. Hee <laughs> hee. I don't think we'll be able to get Joel with a wither rose today, so we might as well run away with a slightly successful prank. Is it a prank? I don't know. I keep trying to zoom into myself. Y'all can't see me. I can't even see me. I believe he's noticed. <laughs> what the? <laughs> oh, now I wish we stayed over there to see the reaction. <laughs> ba -ba -da -ba -ba. Was it you who moved my shulker boxes, Quip? Uh, maybe, maybe. No, what? No, no. Why, who would do that? That's rude. 
that was very weird. A weird <laughs> thing to do. I I've died so many times today that I had to start messing around with some people, and my goal okay. was to get everybody with a wither rose, but. You don't have any places I can put wither roses in your entire area, so I couldn't do it. So I had to find yeah. another way to mess with you, and I figured that was the builder's way to mess with another builder. Is I was very confused. I thought boxes. for a second, did I do that? And then I realized <laughs> I didn't. So I'm gonna go back in the replay mod and watch you do it because I've saved that. I thought it was Lizzie. Yeah, I started shouting at Lizzie. <laughs> uh, I don't know how to feel about that. I just feel violated a little bit, if anything. Okay, okay, okay. But but you know, I I know we had like a Romeo and Juliet connection going on, Joel, and I know yeah, you're not really true. afraid of death things like that. Uh I've I've died quite a few times today to wither roses and withery things. Yeah. You, you want to take one for the team and join me so I'm not alone? I feel lonely. What? Die right now? Yeah, just like a nice little wither rose. Yeah. I'll take a wither rose, but I won't die to a wither rose. No, no, no. no I'm in the no. middle of building, Fripp. I'm not sure right, you can okay, see. Okay, fine, 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 fine. You, you fine, fine. I'll die to it later. I'll, I'll okay, you know deal. what. Mm -hmm. I'll die Thanks. to it later. When, if you're not online, I'll send you a, a, a clip of it. <laughs> or a deal. I'll send you a screenshot. <laughs> now, you might recall at the start of today's episode, we collected a lot of sand. And, well, I do have a plan for that one. And don't worry, my friends, it's been quite a while since we've done any experiments here on the Deep Slate Redstone, and I think we gotta bring that back. This is just so shiny. Man, I'm getting cleaned out of my stock over here. People keep coming over and grabbing some. These trade deals, I gotta maybe rein them in a little bit. We're giving out a little too much gunpowder. Not quite as much as I was hoping for, but that's half a chest full. Now I need to conduct a quick experiment over here, and unfortunately, I think one of these is gonna, it's gonna go kaboom. Nope, nope, we can use one of these. Ugh, gross, disgusting. Ugh, look at it. Look how terrible it is. Ugh, it's awful. Gross. Now, my experiment right here, we can do right in front of the Aztec Empire because that should be okay, but we'll do it with the water so it's totally safe. If we place that right there and then we walk on top of it, that doesn't ignite it. I thought that it puts a redstone signal out. You might see where I'm going with this one now, but I think if we use an observer. Oh, it does ignite it. Okay, perfect. This can work. I'm just gonna leave that here. Blech, disgusting, gross, awful, who wants that? Now for some fun, as we wanna grow the corruption in this area, we want the Deep Slate Redstone to be the source of corruption in this world. Not that little Zorzor dude. No, 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 no. This, this right here, superior. The best source of corruption. And we need to grow it off in this direction. Obviously the wall did not keep him out, so we need another source of protection outside in front of it. And that is where the beautiful TNT comes in. I'm gonna start right about over here so it doesn't harm our new field that we just started, and I'm gonna dig down, straight down, I think 20, 30 blocks each time, and see if we can't just get a bunch of pillars of this stuff and make it explode into an entire ravine. However, the fun part of this one is, I wanna trick somebody else to walk onto it and think that they absolutely ruined our place. I think that'd be hilarious. So we're gonna cover every single one of these. All right, my friends, I've got it. I've got the plan. We need to die one of these sheep. Let's take, nope, that's cow. We can't take cow. Let's take you, dying you as a fake blood sheep over here and come with me, my little friend. Sausage is online right now and I wanna see if we can rope on our uh, wizarding friend, Jim, as well to come and investigate a little source of corruption I've created over here. From the demon coming to attack the deep slate redstone that's starting to lurch its way out of the ground as its own source of corruption. Maybe I'm, I'm gonna try and play it off as Zornoth is trying to stop it over here. And then also Sausage sent over one of the blood sheep and I'm gonna call it out for it and make sure he takes his blood sheep back home with him. But secretly, I know Jem loves to run around and jump on top of things as we're chatting. So I'm gonna see if I can get her to jump on top of that. So I gathered you both over here today because Sausage, one of your stupid spies is there. And Jem, oh. there's a lot of corruption and I need your help. You told me to get rid of it. I don't Flip, know. I, I did tell you to get working. rid of it. Yeah, I tried. No, don't get rid I, yeah, of it. It's so pretty. What did you try? Like a broom? You need some magic or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got all I the magic you need. I got rid of all the blood stains in the village and it looks beautiful oh in there. Gosh. And Why now we're now we're over here oh in sausage. Oh. You oh, need to take this sheep. thing back home with you. Up. They're not welcome I'll here. I'll take them. I'll take them back. Don't worry. Oh, I got yeah. this. Mm -hmm. so we, uh, it's gross. So it's wait. Gross. So you think that this is going to be the key oh, to something? Oh. You, what, what uh, happened? Uh, no, uh, sausage! Uh, <laughs> sausage. <laughs> I guess I guess the corruption Quit. isn't wanted here. What happened but, to sausage? Uh, so what do, you do I think, do about this? Do you this? think it was a negative reaction? Like that's what happened. Yeah, I think I that... think it doesn't I think it doesn't like each other. That's that's what I'm getting over here. 
I'm thinking it really uh, doesn't. Mm, that's. I don't like that your land spawns TNT. Personally. Yeah, yeah. I wonder how that got there. Wow, how could that happen? <laughs> oh, here, that's blood sheep. You're so weird. That was so good. Yeah. What you guys don't know <laughs> is that every time I get sacrificed next to a blood sheep, my power grows even stronger. So oh, thank you. Oh yeah, that's you. just what we needed. That's Does it do the reverse oh, yeah. if there's no blood sheep around? Yeah, yeah. I get weaker, so a blood sheep needs to be around all the time. No sacrifices. <laughs> 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 Ooh, a free head. I'll take it. Well, I guess on that note, I need to figure out um, what to do with that hole over there. So yeah, and do a better job with the cleaning, please. Yeah, I'll work on I'll work on the cleaning front. Thank oh, thank fun. you for the assistance. I think. Uh, yeah, that was great. I, thank I you assisted. so much. I appreciate dying. <laughs> Here we go. One for your collection too. <laughs> <Have one. laughs> He's too fun to kill. Yeah, it's, this, this is, is so I, good. I, I can't wait. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's that's good. That's yep. That's nice. That's that's, that's fine. Yeah, yeah. That's, you yeah. need some more stakes out here. We got some heads to add. My phantom. Get me. There are a lot of them. Holy cow! Go away, please. Kill me. There we go. Phantoms. Now we can have the the three oh. sausages of the apocalypse out here oh my god they're oh. special ones wow, too. Jim, oh, look at look, that you, you look, look handsome very nice very very very, very the handsome. beard look the bearded lady has arrived uh, <laughs> yeah you know you're <laughs> actually a little bit more wizardy when you wear those yep, yep, yep no yep. i don't dress like apprentice wizards only powerful ones listen to me jim there's three of me now here That's actually your head there's on four you you're the front doorman you. you're the front door greeter oh, yeah, over there on. too if you didn't know right here oh yeah no but no but this this is the only three of this Wizard, ah, uh, sorcerer, robe. Well, look at that. Mm. Quite unique. Mm. Is that a is that a thank you for coming over and helping today, or yeah. now I just have a giant hole in my landscape and I don't know what to do? Yeah, with we it. definitely helped. We yeah, were definitely helped. Lot. Yep. This Thanks. Was, this was a good meeting of the alliances. Yeah, right, great so. meeting. Um, um, until next time. Actually, yeah, wait, 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 wait. Before you, before y'all leave, before y'all leave. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. this, for for the oh um. Yep. There we go. If you would like any, feel free <gasps> to take some. Yes. Whoa. Give me cool. all of them! No! Not all of them! No, wait! I, 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 I put them back! Oh, he had so many! What <laughs> he thief. took them all! Okay, I took I took two decks. <laughs> See, Unlimited that's a respectable power. amount. That is a respectable amount, stacks, not actually. 20 take... stacks. Fine, okay, I get like two, three stacks. Is three stacks okay? Okay, for three stacks for the last death, you can have a third stack, yeah. Oh, thank you. Okay, four stacks. Thanks. No! Oh my gosh. Whatever. Oh, Wizards aren't meant to be greedy. On. You need some wizard lessons. Jim, you're the one who said that you, you don't need to steal everything because you own everything last time I talked to you, so. Well, yeah, but I'm the most powerful wizard on the server. You're just an apprentice. For now, Jim. Mm hmm. Uh, okay. Yep. The For great now. three best friends that anyone could have were the three don't do best it. friends that anyone could have. Don't you do it. 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 Three best friends. Sausage. Don't do it, Jim. Three best friends. Mm. Don't you do it, Jim. 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 Anyone. Sausage. You shouldn't threaten a wizard. I'm not doing it. I'm not. Oh, look, Joel's online. Anyway. You did it, Jim. Get out of here. She's on fire. Now this right here, my friends, is going to be such a fun build. I've been collecting resources like crazy, and I've got a great idea in mind. First involves knocking this cow in the ravine. Get in the ravine, go! He does not want to go in the ravine. You, mm, we're making this happen, cow. Oh, maybe you're not. In stake form. So over here, I've got a bunch of red glass, red glass. We've got all of the cobble deep slate we're gonna need. And then I've got a bunch of lava down here because I'm thinking we do the foggy effect to fill this entire thing. So we have lava flowing from up there all the way down to the base here. I put a cobblestone floor at the bottom just to smooth it out a touch for ourselves. It's gonna be a lot of glass, but you know, we harvested sand for an hour earlier today. So we should hopefully have enough. But anyways, my friends, one more time in today's episode, let's go ahead and kick this off in a good old fashioned time-lapse mode. We 
We have done it, my friends. After the mishap there with Sausage and Gem, finally this place is filled in and it is looking absolutely fantastic. I love this thing. I think I put so much red glass on here that there is no way at all to see the lava down there. And I don't think the glow really comes through all that much. So I put some glow lichen up here to help fix that a little bit. But that has been one absolutely jam-packed episode. I do hope y'all enjoyed this one here, but that is all I've got time for. My friends, thank you so very much for watching. Please be sure to leave a like down below if you did enjoy today's video. If brand new, consider subscribing. Thank you all so very much for everybody doing that. We are flying towards 700,000 subs right now, which is absolutely insane. So thank you all so very much, but I'm out of here for now. So with that, my friends, I will catch you on the flip side.